So when we say feeding, what we mean is to supplement the hive during periods when it's either too cold for the bees to fly or when there's no flowers in bloom. Typically, we feed in the fall and in early spring if we have to. We want to feed the hive in the fall to make sure that the bees have enough food to survive the winter. The bees won't eat the syrup right away, but what they'll do is they'll store it in the hive and then access it periodically during the winter to stay warm. The first thing you want to do before feeding your hive is bring it down to one bee box because that's how they're going to spend the winter. Yes, some beekeepers tend to overwinter their hives in two bee boxes, but in my experience I've found that one bee box is more than enough space and they actually come out of the winter stronger. So once the bees actually survive the winter, there can be a period in early spring when the, the bees run out of food. It's a very tricky and fragile period for the bees because they may be able to fly, but there's nothing in bloom yet. So feeding becomes your only option to save the hive. To feed your bees, you want to make sure you place your feeder on top of the inner cover. That way you're not breaking the coelopropolis that the bees have worked very hard to produce throughout the whole summer and which really serves as insulation um, for the cold days. So let me show you how you do this. It'll typically take one or two days for the bees to eat up all the sugar syrup and bring it down and store it in the hive. So once you realize that all the sugar syrup has disappeared into the hive, what you want to do is uh, use a bit of smoke and a bee brush if you have to, and just remove all of the bees from your feeder as you take it off. Make sure to check your chimney, um, this handy little thing, for any bees that might be left over. And then what you want to do is shake these bees into the hive. Um, They'll land on the inner cover and then rejoin the colony as one big happy family um, and what more could you ask? For the specific recipe on how to make sugar syrup, check out our article.